guys, Ben Holdred here with Surveyor coming to you live from the Forest River studio. Man, I'm excited today to bring you a brand new mid-size bunkhouse floor plan, part of our Legend series, the 260 BHLE. This thing is loaded with features. Again, mid-size bunk, double over double setup. It's got a private bedroom, unbelievable setup inside. It's under 30 feet, 29 feet, 11 inches, only 5,700 pounds, so half ton towable. Uh, let's get into some of the top selling features. All right, we're out in front of the brand new 260 BHLE. Again, part of our Legend series. You can see the Legend front end here, beautiful front window, automotive style front window here. Let's take a look at some of the top features we've got going on up front. Standard power tongue jack. Uh, we didn't talk about the price point, but this is gonna be at an unbelievable price point out there in the retail market. Um, but don't let that fool you. This is loaded with standard features. Uh, let's keep uh, walking through these here. We've got Got standard dual propane anytime we have a dual axle setup you're gonna get dual propane tanks with the cover come on over here I want to show you standard standard battery disconnect as well and then this is what you're gonna see on all our 2023 models uh, this is the repeater for your standard TPMS system tire pressure monitoring system uh, this is an unbelievable feature for you the customer uh, this is gonna help you get off the road safely if you have an issue it's gonna monitor tire pressure it's gonna monitor heat uh, it's going to have various alarms. It's going to notify you if you have a slow leak or a fast leak. Uh, but like I said, ultimately get you off the road before you have a blowout, uh, before you have any other issues. Um, so keep that in mind. Great feature for 2023. We've also got a couple more things here. We've got um, a nice holder here for your seven-way plug, getting it off the ground out of the snow and the dirt. And then we've got a standard a utility hook here, versatile setup here. You can lock your bikes up to it. You can hook a uh, pet, uh, pet leash up to it. A lot of different things you can do here. Uh, so let's keep moving. I want to show you the pass-through storage we've got going on here in this 260BH. Full pass-through. Get a look at that. You're also going to notice you've got aluminum bed bases in there, uh, giving you more durability in the bedroom. This is going to be a high use area, obviously. Uh, you're sleeping in there every night, so we, we gave you an upgraded feature there with an aluminum bed base. Not everybody does that. We've also got motion lighting up here as well, standard feature uh, on all of our floor plans. And then we, we include here a three quarter inch drill bit for your man, uh, manual jacks. Very easy to hook this up to a screw gun um, and zip them up and down. Again, that's a standard feature on all surveyor floor plans. Let's move to the entrance door here. Nice big grab handle. As you're walking inside, we've got our, our brand new feature for 2023, the black glass entry door. Uh, this is again gonna be a standard feature. And you've got uh, the built-in window with the shade prep, so you can do that aftermarket. Moride steps, standard um, on this 260BH. Very easy to adjust the legs. You've got a big wide step up top on this Moride step. Um, and you'll see you've got the surveyor cut out as well uh, with the night light behind it. Not everybody does that. When you turn on your porch light, it's going to illuminate those steps. So if you've got pets, kids, or anybody walking up and down at night early in the morning, that's a nice safety feature for them. Let's keep walking here. You're going to notice several stickers we've got here on the side of the coach. Keep in mind, again, tire pressure monitoring system, standard equipment. Don't miss that. Also, we've got standard solar on here, which we'll talk about a little bit later, we've got a standard solar setup on every single floor plan that we offer. Uh, aluminum wheels here, check out this setup here, black aluminum wheels, every single model you got it here on the 260. We also have a sealed and true heated underbelly on this product. What I mean by that is you've got a sealed underbelly so everything's protected and you've got a true heated underbelly. So we've got a dedicated duct that's forcing hot air to the underbelly when you're running your furnace. Uh, a lot of guys are just using radiant heat off the ducting, this is a better setup uh, and we've got it on every single model, so keep that in mind. Let's keep moving here to this outside kitchen setup. As you guys know that follow this brand, we've got a standard outside kitchen on every single model. There's very few lightweights on the market that can say that, that's a big deal. I mean, how many times have you found a floor plan that you loved and it was missing something, it was missing an outside kitchen, you had to sacrifice, you don't have to do that here standard outside kitchen nice big setup on this 260 bh it's got everything you need suburban elite series griddle flat top griddle it's got a nice prep table here that pulls out as well mini refrigerator and then it's got a nice dump sink here with access to your fresh water it's going to include a hose the dump sink but this all folds up very easily uh, it's gas strut assisted so very easy to get in and out but it's not going to slide out on you um, automatically it's going to stay nice and uh, nice and firm in there as you're going down the road um, but again 
very easy to use, very compact, gives you everything you need, but doesn't take a lot of interior storage away as well. So a great setup on this 260BH. Let's keep moving to the back here. We've got some great standard features. We've got a standard roof ladder on every surveyor floor plan, fully walkable roof. Keep that in mind. Not everybody can say that. Uh, we've got a standard roof ladder and a, a roof that's built to walk on. PVC membrane up there, it's the best roof material on the market, no question about it. What I love about it is you never have to treat it. Uh, some of these roof materials, you have to treat them once a year, protect them from UV rays. Uh, you don't have to do that here. You need to get up there and do your uh, maintenance, um, but nothing else you have to do to it. It's essentially maintenance free uh, from that treatment standpoint. So keep that in mind, but it's the most durable material out there on the market as well. Uh, but we've got some great features back here in addition to that standard bike door it's on a friction hinge this is going to allow you to put a full-size kayak in the back here you can put bikes in here uh, anything you want to store in the back but a ton of space again this is gas strut assisted not everybody does that we've also got a nice magnet set up here holding it down in transit but a great setup for bikes or kayaks or anything you want to put in there some additional storage um, and again on a friction hinge so when you're loading that stuff up it's not going to close on you one thing i want you to notice there's guys that are doing this bike door setup, but nobody does it quite like we do. Um, the way we've got it set up, you can still put the fold down cargo rack on the back of this model. You're gonna notice as you're out there shopping around for bunk houses, uh, there's not many people that can say that, that can offer the fold down rack with the bike door. And we can do it at Surveyor, so keep that in mind as you're shopping around. Uh, let's head back up front and we're going to head inside. We've got some unbelievable features to show you in there. Let's get into it. All right, we're inside the brand new 260 BHLE bunkhouse. Again, double over double, private bedroom, unbelievable bedroom setup. Gets you away from the kids, closes you off under 30 feet. Very rare out there and at 5,700 pounds, unbelievable half ton towable. Let's check out this bedroom setup. Double doors heading into the bedroom walk around bed tons of walk around space here let's check this out and tons of storage you guys know how we do the bedroom setup uh, in the surveyor lineup tons of storage in here we try to utilize all the space you've got oversized wardrobes here two drawers on each side you don't usually see that you've got power and usb on both sides of the bed as well of course your front window here for some natural light and then we've got the standard cubby setup that you see in our front bedrooms in the surveyor brand uh, we've got cup holders back there we've got uh, power outlets down below some hidden storage under that shelf there and then you've got a nice little cubby shelf tucked in there as well on both sides for um, additional items books uh, drinks whatever you want to put up there but unbelievable setup some nice overhead storage as well that's got a gas strut not everybody does that and of course you've got ducted uh, ac in the bedroom as well and, and a prep area for a second tv if you want to do that here but huge entryway walking into this bedroom area again double doors great bedroom setup and again private bedroom under 30 feet uh, in this 260 bunkhouse all right let's check out the kitchen you've got an unbelievable kitchen setup in here with a bar top uh, that's something you're not going to see um, in a similar floor plan like this on the market so let's check it out all right let's check out the kitchen of this 260 bhle it's got some unbelievable features some unique stuff here that you're not going to see in competing floor plans let's check out this bar area as soon as you walk in the door you've got this nice bar top you can sit here eat dinner have drinks uh, play cards whatever you want to do but just a great additional seating setup that you're not going to find out there uh, in comparable floor plans nice bar stools here as you walk in you've also got some nice coat hooks on the wall residential coat hooks but let's check out this kitchen area i'm telling you if you've seen a similar floor plan like this on the market you haven't seen one with all this counter space in this kitchen setup this is unique uh, and you're only going to find it in the surveyor lineup so keep that in mind look at all this counter space here huge sink you can wash pans whatever you want to do in there it's big enough to do that but look at all this counter space that you've got here. You've got a residential cutting board for 2023. Nice big campsite window. So when you're working in the kitchen, uh, you can see outside, enjoy that campsite view. Uh, you've got a TV here that's on a swing arm. So when you're sitting here at the dinette, um, and we'll talk about what you can do with that versatile dinette in a minute. But when you're sitting there, you can easily see the TV. You can swing it to the bedroom if you want as well. Uh, but just remember, you've got a place for a bedroom TV as well. So you don't really need to do that. Um, but very easy viewing here uh, from the dinette to the TV area and just a ton of counter space. A lot of times you'll find um, in a similar floor plan, this is just one big bulky entertainment center. Uh, we open this up to give you more counter space, more windows, 
uh, and it just feels huge in here. It does not feel like a 30 foot unit, so keep that in mind. Let's keep moving uh, to the back here. Again, we've got double over du double bunks, uh, standard uh, ladder here to get up to that second bunk. And again, we've got that rear bike door. You can fit a full size kayak in here like we talked about, but this bottom bunk is gonna flip up. And again, you've got a standard magnet set up. So when you're in transit, it's gonna hold it down for you. Uh, you've got individual lights back here for the kids and USBs so they can plug in uh, their iPads, phones, whatever they've got back there. But nice big bunks, 300 pound weight rating. Um, just a great setup back here for the kids. And it's right next to the dining area. Just a great setup uh, if you've got people hanging out in here. So keep that in mind. Let's check out some of this storage. I skipped over that in the kitchen. You've got a ton going on in here. Uh, of course, you've got your Furion appliances. Uh, your microwave, your range, um, but, but a ton of storage in here. Nice big pull-out drawers. Of course, you've got your Surveyor brown, uh, branded bottle opener here as well, but tons of storage. Look at all the storage we've got here, um, and I'll show you some additional storage behind me uh, before we check out that bathroom area. But again, for 2023, I want to point out standard central vac system. Uh, this is a great system. You kick it up with your feet. Uh, you sweep into it. It also comes with an accessory kit. Uh, with some additional hoses that you can hook up as well. But this is one of the uh, unique features you're gonna find in our brand, uh, in our group, uh, that you're not gonna see uh, in other lightweight trailers. So keep that in mind, standard central vac system. Uh, before we head to the bathroom area, I wanna point out a couple things in here that you're gonna notice when you step in this 260. It just feels bigger uh, than similar size trailers out there. Taller ceilings, we've got 82 inch ceilings in here and taller slide outs, six foot tall slide out boxes. I can walk right into this slide out box here without bending over. Just an elevated level of comfort uh, in this surveyor lineup. Um, just an overall great setup we've got. But again, 82 inch flat ceilings, it just gives you more room, makes it feel more comfortable. So keep that in mind uh, as you're out looking around. And again, we've got standard uh, 15 K AC throughout our entire lineup as well. And we've got heat ducted through the cabinets. And again, we've got that dedicated duct to the underbelly force and air down there. Uh, when you run your furnace here really set up great for extended season capability let's head into the bathroom here i'm going to uh, point out some of the great features we've got all right check out the bathroom of this 260 bh nice big bathroom you wouldn't expect a bathroom this big under 30 feet but you've got a ton of space in here uh, look look how much room i've got standard porcelain toilet you've got plenty of counter space here to put all your toiletries anything you want to do here um, and we've also got uh, Surfex countertops here. One thing I did not point out in the kitchen, we've got Surfex uh, laminated countertops throughout. No T-mold. Um, I want you to pay attention to that as you're shopping around. A lot of times in the bathroom especially, or on the dinette, um, some of these brands will cut corners and put T-molded countertops in these areas. This is an area that's going to get wet. If you have T-mold, um, it's only a matter of time before those fall apart, so keep that in mind. We gave you a better feature in here. A residential toilet paper holder as well, and uh, some nice storage as well underneath. You've got the residential mirror with the storage behind it, toothbrush holders, um, and some additional medicine cabinet storage, so great setup. We've got an upgraded shower door here in this 260. Slow close, black door here, really nice look. It's gonna be a mildew resistant material, so it's not gonna get nasty on you, easy to maintain, and it's gonna squeegee itself. So unlike a glass door or something like that, uh, where you have to squeegee it, uh, this is gonna take care of itself, but a nice big shower. And we always put the skylight in here for taller people as well, uh, giving you some natural light, but also some additional height as well. Um, let's step out here. I wanna show you one more thing before we wrap up. I showed you all the kitchen storage we've got. We've got even more storage here in the kitchen, pantry area with built-in shelves. Um, just a ton of space here uh, for additional storage, food, clothes, whatever you want to do there. Um, a ton of storage going on in this 260. It's unbelievable. Um, you're not going to believe it when you see it. Let's check out this dinette area. We talked about how tall these slide out boxes are. Just an elevated level of comfort. We didn't miss anything here in the dinette as well. We did a booth dinette. There's a reason we do that opposed to a U-shaped dinette. Um, sometimes, guys, the, the U-shapes look bigger. I'll give you that, but they're not. You can't sit four adults comfortably at a U-shaped dinette. You can sit a couple kids on the corners um, and maybe a couple adults in there. You can sit four adults here. You can sit down, play cards, eat your dinner, hang out. Uh, it's very comfortable. And we've got some nice gas strut-assisted storage underneath here, the easy access storage uh, that you guys see in our lineup. But a great setup here for four adults to hang out. I'm a big card player, so this is a setup that I gotta have. Uh, but we've got some big windows here 
ventilated window here in the slide out. Nice big picture window here, again, letting you see the outdoors uh, and a residential light here as well. Let's keep moving. I want to show you another top feature that you're going to see in this lineup. The Furion Black Glass Refrigerator, 12 volt only. Um, this is a great setup. It pairs really well with our standard solar that we've got on here. Um, but this gives you 10 cubic feet of storage in here. Um, I want you to keep that in mind because when you get under 30 feet, um, a lot of times you're going to sacrifice in these other brands. You're going to get a smaller refrigerator um, or some things like that, especially at this price point. I'm telling you, you won't believe um, what this is going to land at price-wise. And uh, But we didn't cut any corners. Uh, we gave you all the standard features we typically do. Um, but you've got a ton of storage here, big freezer, uh, big refrigerator. And keep in mind, uh, we do have the gas electric refrigerator option uh, if you want to do that as well, if you're going off the grid for an extended period of time. But we've got great solar capabilities as well. So this 12 volt is tried and true. Uh, it's a great setup, um, very efficient. I want to point out one thing that not everybody does. We've got what's called a dry mode, um, excuse me, not a dry mode, off the grid mode in this Furion uh, refrigerator. Uh, what you do is you cool this down before you go on your trip, cool it down to temperature, then you load it up with your food, um, then you hit the road, get to your campsite. When you get there, you turn it down to this off the grid setting. It's gonna draw less power. So it's gonna draw less battery um, and allow you to use that battery power, your solar capabilities to, to power other stuff. So keep that in mind. That off the grid setting is a great feature uh, you're not gonna see in other, on other refrigerators. Um, let's talk about solar before we head outside and wrap up. Again, we've got a Go Power system here. You're gonna see the 10 amp controller. Uh, we've got an 80 watt solar panel on the roof of this 260. So you're solar ready, ready to go. Um, but one thing I want you to keep in mind, that is a 10 amp controller that can handle about 200 watts of solar. If you want to go above 200 watts, uh, it's already pre-wired for a 30 amp controller. So you just have to plug and play and that'll allow you to go up to 600 watts of solar. Uh, so we've given you the 80 watt, but it's very easy to add more solar panels to that setup if you find yourself going off the grid for a longer period of time. So keep that in mind, but, but Go Power is one of the original solar companies, been in the business for over 25 years. Uh, great company, quality products. Uh, so keep that in mind, something to consider as well. Um, but let's head outside. But I'm telling you this 260, it is loaded with features. The price is right and uh, you guys are gonna love it. So I encourage you to, to call your local dealer and, and find one, they're gonna be hitting the ground soon. Let's head outside and wrap this up. All right, guys, thanks for joining me for a walkthrough with a brand new 260 BHLE, part of our Legend series. Again, private bedroom, under 30 feet, double over double bunks, unbelievable kitchen setup. Uh, we showed you all the counter space, all the room you've got inside. Just an unbelievable setup, under 30 feet. You're not going to find it out there anywhere else in the lightweight segment. Uh, for more information on this 260 or any other floor plan we've got, you can always go to our website, forestriverinc.com slash surveyor. Ask us questions, follow us on YouTube, follow our Facebook page. We're always posting new content. Thanks for joining me.